Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to today's online class. The topic is agricultural mechanization slash engineering two. Two of two. Earlier, we have treated that of one of two because this topic is divided into two and this is the remaining part of it. So, as we have been, been treating farm machines, another example is milking machine. And milking machine is the type of the machine that is used to extract raw milk from dairy animals. That is, the animals that produces uh, milk. And milking machines has the following parts we have it is made up of electrical motor the vacuum pump source of power milk pail vacuum controller four teeth cups pipeline and support frame by diagram we have this i'm going to explain them one by one we have the vacuum pump the vacuum pump, the work is that it, once it is powered by electric motor, it will suck out the raw milk from the cow through t these teeth cups. And the teeth cups, they are four. The teeth cups are attached to the udder of the dairy animal in order to let out or extract raw milk. Then the raw milk passes through this pipeline into this milk pail. Okay? Now, it has handle. I've said this that it is a Teeth cups is also called milk claw, but let's go with teeth cups. They are four in number. Okay, it also has vacuum gauge. This control the vacuum on how it extracts the milk. We also have motor. The motor generates the Electri electrical power that power the vacuum pump. We have support frame. The support frame is the frame on which other parts are seated or housed. It has rubber wheel, rubber wheel tire that enables movement because the machine, the milking machine are being carried from one place to another. All right. Now, look at the milking machine in operation. You can see here, this is the milking pail. This is the pipeline through which the milk is passing through into the pail. And here, is the cow that is being milked in a milking parlor. And here are the four teeth cups that are attached to the udder of the animal, okay, in order to extract milk, raw milk from the cow. This is another example. I hope you can see it very clearly here. Okay? And this is happening in the milk parlor where the milking, the environment where the milking is being carried out. Here is also an, an example of a milking parlor, but in a small scale.
Here is another milking parlor done in a very big uh, scale. The cows are within this compartment and many cows are being milked at the same time. Here is manual milking of cow with ants. This is done at a local level where ants are used instead of using milking machine. Function of milking machine. It is used for extracting fresh raw milk mechanically from the udder of dairy animals such as the cow, the doe, that is the female of a goat, and the ewe, that is the female of the sheep. The process by which fresh milk is collected The process by which fresh milk is collected with milking machine is made fit for human consumption is called pasteurization. Pasteurization, that is after the collection of the milk from the dairy animal, it cannot be consumed directly like that because you have to pasteurize it in order to kill some germs that may be in it. We have economic importance of milk. One, it is a source of protein in food. It supplies minerals to livestock for raising foster kids, calves, lambs, and children. That is, new, newborn of goats, that is the kids are being fed with the uh, raw, with the milk. But as I said, that you have to pasteurize them before you give it to them. Apply some temperature to make it a little bit warm so that the germs in it will die before they can be fed to the kids, calves, and also for children. Four, for preparation of baby food and also for preparation of dairy products such as we have the the powdered milk condensed milk butter cheese and the rest of them six as an extender in artificial insemination practices when you are carrying out insemination the milk is one of the substances that are used as extender. Other tools or equipment used in dairy farm are as follows. One, feed trough for feeding of the, the container that you put in the feed of the animal. Water trough, that is the trough or the container through which they drink water. Milking parlor, that is the place where you take the milking animal to, the dairy animal in, and begin milking from, from there. Silage fork is the fork that you use to move silage from one place to another within the dairy uh, section. Drenching bottle is the type of bottle in which you put in milk to feed the kids or the lamb of young uh, dairy animals. Milking pail, I've shown you that before, the pail in which the milk are being collected in. Forage dryer is the type of machine that dries the forage after harvest so that you can store them for future use. Body saw. This is a, this is a device that is used to castrate 
the male animal. That is, you break the blood vessel that leads to the testes of the animal. So the, the animal will not be able to produce sperm. That is, it will not be able to fertilize any uh, female animal. It will not be able to impregnate or mate with uh, female animal. Buckets. The buckets are used for feeding the kids or the calves of the young dairy animals. Forage harvester. This is a, a machine that is used to harvest forage from the pasture land to, to be fed to the animals. We have ample contaminants of milk in dairy farm. In the dairy farm, all these contaminants on this screen, they do contaminate the milk. We have the stones, bacteria, urine, deaths from tools, droplets from sick animals, excreta. Excreta is a mixture of urine and the feces of the animal. The straw, the silage, body air, of the, that is the air of the animal, falling off from the air of the animal, falling off from the air of the animal, insects and dust, all these can contaminate the animal. They can contaminate the milk. Precautions to be taken during milking. One, clean, cleaning of animals before milking. Testing for milk. If you want to milk any dairy animal, press the udder into a test cup. The milk that falls inside will be tested to know if the milk in the udder is okay or not. Three, milk animals in clean environments. Observe hygienic rules, avoid smoking during milking, and show care to the animals. With this, we have come to the end of this topic. Assignment follows it, do it, and submit. Thank you for listening.